best films, including Sheba by the Dozen, One and Two, and A Cinderella Story. Later this summer, you can see her in Material Girls. Please welcome Hilary Duff. <laughs> Thank you. My feet don't touch the ground. Oh, yeah. Every time I come here, my feet don't We've touch the ground. We've got to do something about this chair. Everyone complains about this chair. We went to, like, Crate and Barrow and bought the best one we could. <laughs> well, we got to get a new one. But you look Not beautiful. Not everyone is as tall as you, Conan. I know. It's my own fault. I just like to see people's feet dangle. Okay. I'm a perv. Uh... <laughs> But, but thanks for being here. Sure, thank and you for having you, me. And congratulations. I mean, think about it today. You've had so much success. I was mentioning you've sort of conquered these different areas of the show business world, and you're so young. You're 18 years old. Yeah. I'm telling you, I like that. Uh, you're 18 <laughs> years old, you know. <laughs> How old were you when you started in, in this business? You started very young. I did. I, I was about, like, uh, it was probably 10 years ago. Right. So, um, I mean, Eight I Eight years old. Texas. Wow. Yeah. Incredible. I started doing, like, commercials in Texas, and then we moved to California and kind of went back and forth. And right. It's actually a funny story because this business is so, I mean, it's so adult, you know. Mm -hmm. And, and um, I booked this movie that was um, a straight-to-video movie. Mm -hmm. And they were using all these words, and I was, like, learning all this stuff that I had, was so unfamiliar with. And yeah, you were so young. Yeah. Right. And so the director was using words like, Hillary, um, hug the couch, or Hillary... Like, when you walk through the room, banana. And I'm like, what does that stuff mean? You I don't know? know what that means, and I'm 43. Well, I'm thank you. So I'm like, I've been in this business a long time, and I don't know what that right. means. So I'm, like, running, running through this um, room, and I go, and he's like, Hillary, hug the couch. And Which I just, means, what? just like, yeah, just get just, closer to it. Right. And I'm like, all right, I'm going to do it. I'm just going to go and hug it. Like, I really love it. <laughs> <laughs> I totally, and everyone was like, yeah, what is she yeah. doing? See, that's something I would do now, yeah. Uh, well, whatever you're doing is working. You have a huge following. I mean, wherever you go, this young people show up. Today at the show, when, when people find out that you were going to be on our program, all these uh, fans showed up. Actually, really? we have videotape of them out in the hallway, I think. And they're just, yeah, they're going crazy for you. Oh, I hope I get to meet her. I hope I get to meet her. Let the rain fall down. Let the rain fall down and wake my dream. Joel Goddard, our announcer. Joel, Joel is so excited. He's in the announce booth right now, Joel. I think you're here somewhere. Joel is so excited. Hi, yeah. Hillary. I love you. <laughs> yeah. Thank Very nice. You. Yeah. A lot of Korean War veterans are behind you. Uh, Brandon, there's some pretty scary people working back there. Yeah, yeah, we're a freak show. Uh, <laughs> didn't your people tell you that? <laughs> um, gave me that warning. Uh, you know, it's what you're in this in this world of show business where so much is written about you in the tabloids. Yeah. I have avoided that successfully. <laughs> we don't know how. Uh, oh, right, I'm uninteresting. Uh, <laughs> but you have, you, they write about you constantly, and they're, they're, they write a lot of crazy things about you. What's some of the more insane things you've read about yourself in the tabloids lately? Oh, my gosh. Uh, you know what? It's really unavoidable. They're just mm -hmm. going to make stuff up when you don't give them anything to write about. Right. But um, I read that, you know, my sister and I live together, and mm -hmm. I read that recently we burnt down half of our house from the toaster. Mm -hmm. How anybody does that is beyond me. Right. But, we might uh, have a whole house. Why half yeah, the house? Yeah. The it was very odd. But so they could just write that and nothing like that happened at all. There was no... no. Yeah. Yeah. No. Um, I mean, I read that, actually we were doing this rain shot in one of my movies, and mm -hmm. they were using glycerin because it shows up on the camera better. Mm -hmm. And one of the drops got in my eye, and it made, like, all my makeup. I mean, my eye water and all my makeup came down, and we just had to go and fix it, you mm -hmm. know? So we had to go into the trailer and fix my makeup, and it wasn't like I was like, freaking out or anything. And they right. were like, the next week I read in some of the, like, a tabloid magazine that I would refuse to come out of the trailer unless they brought me a plasma big screen. A pl really? <laughs> See, that I was would... like... I wish I could get that creative. Yeah. But, I mean, but, but also, in a weird way, it makes me think, wow, she's got a lot of power if she can do that, you know? Like, demand a plasma. So I've tried to, I'm throwing a fit here on this show every day. I'm like, I will not come out of my dressing room unless you get me a 1968 Volkswagen Beetle. <laughs> and they don't, and I stay in there, and no one notices. Uh, you have performed, is this right, you've performed twice for President Bush. Is I that have, right? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, is that, I mean, it must be very nerve-wracking performing for the president, is it? Yeah, I think I was nervous. I mean, there's so many people around that are important people mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. um, that are really, um, I mean, 
they work at the White House or they, right, you know, sure. have big, important jobs. And I'm like, mm -hmm. scared, of, you know, and I don't want to say anything wrong. Right. And it's a little nerve-wracking. When, you, when you're singing and the president's out there, are you, can you see what he's doing? Is he rocking out? I mean, is he... <laughs> can you imagine? No, actually, the first time was at um, a ceremony that went on and was with a lot of um, y young adults. Right, right. And uh, so they were, like, having a good time and being able to, like, stand up and act like they were at a concert. But, mm -hmm. but he wasn't. He just came on the stage later. And then I also performed at the Ford Theater, which was amazing because it has so much history. And he was just sitting there with everybody else. Yeah. He wasn't like, yeah. <laughs> no, it's so funny because I, uh, I, I, I have no idea what he, I've never seen footage of him at a rock concert or a pop show. So I don't, I have no idea what he would be doing. <laughs> but I don't know if you have, you feel like, but then you get to talk to him afterwards, right? Yeah, he came on and he was like, you know, you did such a great job. And um, mm -hmm. <laughs> he wasn't cool. like, I own all your CDs. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, that was Joel Goddard. Yeah, that's, he was right. there for that. Yeah. <laughs> he was, the secret. Yeah. The Secret Service threw him out of that show. Uh, Material Girls. That, Material Girls is uh, is opening in August. Is that yeah, right? I did that with my sister Haley. Oh, great! And um, so it's going to come out in August, and it's mm -hmm. really funny. It's like something different that we've never done before, and um, we got to spend a lot of time together, which was cool. And you guys get along. It's it, you know, I mean, I, I get along with my brothers and sisters, but I don't know what it would be like if I worked with them. I don't well, know. We if live together, right. and we we're like she's my best friend. We have all the same friends, and she's actually in New York right now doing hairspray on Broadway. So I'm going to be spending a lot of time here with her. Oh, good for her. She's all right. Cool. Well, uh, <laughs> Material Girls opens in August, as I mentioned, and uh, Hillary, thanks so much for sure. being here. Yeah, Thank continued you. success Thank to you. Hillary. Neil Patrick.